How would you like to join me in France this October for another wonderful seven day watercolour retreat with Uptrek? Last year I went to the south of France and had an amazing time with a wonderful bunch of women and this year we're heading to a different region of France, we're going to the Dordogne to enjoy their incredible wildlife, plants and flowers in the beautiful autumn that we're going to enjoy a really nice mild weather and sit outside and paint from sight, paint the trees, plants, as well as being back in the artist studio doing some more of my classic botanical style painting. So we're going to be painting a um, little sort of snapshot of the region in Dordogne, plants, flowers, really nice sort of close-up studies. But then also what I'm so excited about is when we head out to the market town, which is only like a 20 minute walk from the venue, we can take our sketchbooks and do a little bit of urban sketching. It's something I've been enjoying so much this year because you get to see the colours, the sights, the sounds, the flower stalls, the market stalls with the fruit and everything. Um, so if you would love to get a sketchbook out and fill it with lovely bright colours and just experiment with your watercolour painting, you may never have left your desk. I was like that for quite a long time. I always wanted to paint right here um, and actually stepping out into the wider world just for a little bit and with my guidance we're going to have a really amazing time. So let me show you a little bit more of where we're going. I wanted to open my sketchbook and show you some of my uh, paintings from recent travels on uh, European little watercolour trips. Um, there's so much joy to be found in filling a sketchbook with lovely little uh, observations of sights and sounds and you don't need to have any prior knowledge about any of that because uh, I'm here to help, here to teach you and so in France, our workshop is going to consist of uh, seven days of staying in this beautiful venue, La Palanque. Um, and the cool thing is my friend Emma Carlyle, uh, who I do a lot of painting with, she's just run a retreat there and she's just got wonderful things to say about it. In fact, she loved it so much, they're going back again this year. Um, and essentially, we're going to have a lovely art room where we can paint and study and learn. And I really want to stress that I want to welcome painters of all abilities. Um, I think for complete 100% beginners, i.e. never picked up a paintbrush before, it might be quite a lot to take on. But if you have recently decided that watercolour is something you'd love to do and you've started dabbling in some of my tutorials on here and you've started maybe got one of my books or two, but you know very much consider yourself a beginner that sounds ideal for this we're going to be painting every day um, interspersed with some lovely trips to the local markets and one or two um, local historical spots which are just going to be great because we'll be there and we'll be able to get our sketchbooks out this is a little dog a, little, a very big dog actually i painted in uh, portugal once but the beauty of painting out and about as well as sitting down in a in a room and painting a study is you can just paint as, as big or as small a, a place as you want. Um, I was recently in Alicante and painted this scene here and I tried some pen and ink as well and that was kind of cool. Um, but anyway what I want to say is yeah the the venue is just so inspiring and very uh, comfortable. We, the, we've got accommodation where there are shared rooms or single rooms depending on your budget and preferences but essentially what I want to say is how special the um, group of women who came to my last workshop was. And in fact, I've done a workshop since in Portugal and yet again, uh, I thought, well, am I going to be able to recreate the magic of the first group? And what was amazing is a completely new um, group of people came together and there was a new magic that happened. So I am so confident that we're all going to have a wonderful time. There's a chef who will cater to any dietary requirements if you have any concerns about that. It's always best to just get in touch with Uptrek whilst you're deciding whether you'd like to come and have one of these 16 spaces. You can contact them uh, using the episode notes below. There's a direct email address and they will answer any question you have about logistics, flights, transfers, but I've never felt so well looked after on a trip. Um, painted a few pigeons when I was in Alicante recently. Um, so anyway, if you feel like this might be something you'd love to do, then 
I urge you to um, head to the episode notes below, find out all you need through a much more um, uh, comprehensive list of details that I'm telling you now. You can see the photos. You can see photos of my attendees from previous trips and what they painted. And in fact, I'm going to show you just a little snapshot of the sort of more sort of usual botanical painting bits that we'll be doing as well as getting our sketchbooks out. So nature has always been my ultimate inspiration and that's why I choose to go to these particular venues. This is a recent piece I've actually been doing with my patrons but it's very much in the style of the kind of paintings that we were doing out in the south of France doing a little snapshot of the local flora and fauna and this lovely sort of new botanical painting style I call it where we capture the essence of plants, animals. If we manage to study a bird for long enough then that'll be fantastic too. We can do some of that. Um, but we very much study it and try it and then we paint it in a way that's not going to take us forever to do. Um, so the other thing that I will say is being out and about on some of our trips, please be mindful that this trip is not well suited to participants with low or limited mobility because there is plenty of walking, there'll be cobbled streets, there'll be a few uneven steps. So I would say have a think about that and um, also ask Uptrek if you have any concerns about that kind of thing. But I really, really look forward to seeing you in October. I can't wait. I'm just so excited. Uh, I hope the pictures that you've seen in this little video will get you excited too for a lovely end of year after the madness of summer. Just a wonderful way to wind down and give yourself some time for yourself. And um, one last little close up. I really want to show you this because I painted this recently and it just brought me so much joy. Um, it was a little study of a flower shop. You can see it's loose. It's a whole other style to this kind of painting and the best thing is is we will be trying out both of those and I will be guiding you there along the way. So the last thing to say Head to the episode notes below for the links to book your ticket or to contact Uptrek and find out more. And I can't wait to see you there.